Ever wonder what kind of houses we have in Leisure Farm? So today I'll take you come and see a three-story semi-D. So once you enter the precinct, when you come to a unit, you have to pass a security guard. But before you pass a security guard, you have to go through to the main security, pass there to go to individual security precinct. Okay, so this unit, you can actually park four cars if you are not driving a big car. But let's say that if you're driving an Alphard, you can actually park one Alphard, one MyV, and two sedan in the front porch. So this is actually quite big for the spacing that they give. Okay, so before that, if you've seen my video, my the other video about Leisure Farm 3 Story Super Link, that unit is more towards up. So this unit we are going to see is that there's a ground floor, there's a first floor, and there's a lower ground floor. Okay, so you guys may be wondering what is a lower ground floor look like. So I will show you what it looks like. Okay, so before I show you what it looks like, this is the layout of the semi D. So it's a 28 times 90. It is a 4 plus 1 bedroom, 4 plus 1 bathroom. And it's a 3,578 square feet for their build out. So their build out is actually quite big and because it's a three story. So it, what is about their land area? Their land area is around 2,530. So it's actually quite okay land and the side got space for you, enough space. Let's take a look at what we have in the inside. Okay, so once you enter, you have a comfortable feeling, a comfy feeling of like a home. And then immediately, this is a powder room where your guests all can use as a toilet here. Okay, so this floor definitely will have one bedroom with its own bathroom. So this will be what the first bedroom once you enter and it has its own bathroom as well. And this unit is for those, normally is the first floor, the bedroom is for like grandparents or uh, your guest room. So parents room or husband and wife room all will always be upstairs. So that it will be the first floor. Okay, so let's take a look at what this area have. So they have powder room, they have a bedroom with its attached bathroom and they have a store room. Okay, so let's take a look at the upper floor where all the rooms are first. Okay, so this unit actually you will feel more higher is because it got a very high ceiling. So this high ceiling is actually give you a very nice feeling that it's not small. It's big and there's window also it got the sunlight that can come come in. Because so on my right side there's two bedrooms. Okay, these two bedrooms share one bathroom on the outside. But this showroom they make it looks like one is a working area and one is for like gathering area. So let's take a look at the first one. This unit they design it to be like a gathering area where your friends or Family members all come together, want to have chit chat, can sit in this room, watch some TV, or you can make into a bedroom, or you can make into a movie room. So a movie you can put a sofa there. A bigger TV if you like, then it will be more comfortable. And the design is all up to you. So this will be the second bedroom. The second bedroom, the design is looks like more to office use. These are all the tables and you can put computers and everything. Lah. But if you want it to be like a bedroom, you can also make it into a bedroom, add a bed. If you want to use this type of table, you can add a single bed. Then it's also like a bedroom already. Okay, let's take a look at the master bedroom. Okay, the master bedroom is actually quite big. It has a balcony and it has walk-in wardrobe. So once you enter, you actually see the spacing here is quite big. The bed, TVs and everything. And you have the balcony over here. Alright, so this balcony has an unblocked view. A very, very nice unblocked view. So as you walk outside, you can actually see the unblocked view. And on the left side of me, you can actually see the swimming pool. The facility floor where the swimming pool are and everything. Quite nice, right? You can see the surrounding swimming pool, the unblocked views and everything. And you got like a special pond in the in between here for this design. All right, so let's take a look at the walk-in wardrobe. So this walk-in wardrobe is actually quite nice because 
for our wife, it's always a nice. It's always the best for them because you got a big mirror, chairs and everything for makeup. For and wardrobe, all ready. And all will be like this. It's quite nice, comfortable. You can put a lot of clothes. And this will be the master bathroom. Master bathroom will always come with a bathtub and a close-up shower head and everything. And standard two sink. So husband and wife each have one sink of their own. So for further ado, let's take a look at the lower ground floor where the kitchen, dining, living hall, everything will be. So I will see you there. All right, we are coming towards to the lower ground floor where all the living rooms and the dining rooms are. And once you come here, down the stairs, you can immediately see this is a living room. See how big the spacing is and how high the ceiling is. This side of ceiling is what normally a lot of people want because it's a high ceiling and you feel more spacious. And this is a comfortable living room where you can put a big sofa and a big TV. Everybody can enjoy movies and everything. And this will be the dining area. We have a long table of an eight-seater dining. And we have uh, access to the outside as well. This outside, you can access out to your extra land, where your extra land can actually have an uh, extra table on the outside for like a uh, garden party and all. You can have barbecue and everything. So this is the outside, what it looks like for the extra land for the corner lot. Okay, so... We take a look at see the dry kitchen. Uh, everybody always wanted a dry kitchen, but some may not. But I personally love dry kitchen because I do cooking, so I love to have a dry kitchen and a wet kitchen. So for dry kitchen, normally we can cook on the outside as well, just that not is heavy cooking. But those who love cooking will love this. Okay, so as a behind, we can actually see that there's cabinets and all, and this is the oven. And these cabinets are all nicely done. But because this is a show unit, so it definitely is nicely done. But when you buy this unit as a bare unit, they actually have cabinets ready for you as well. And there's oven also. Okay, so we are at the back here. We can actually see that this is the wet kitchen. We got the suction and the stove and everything. All will be here ready and you buy it. Okay, so this will be the sink, the long sink for you, and all the cabinets will be done. And this will be the store room. Okay, so this wet kitchen can actually also access to the outside for a garden party. So this access outside here. So the middle that I show you that they also can access, right? So this one also can access, like once you're done cooking, you can immediately bring it out in this area. So you don't need to go through the dining area, you can just go through here. So this small area, you can actually put a washing machine and a dryer because you can do all your washing and everything here. Then maybe you can put an awning and you can hang your clothes outside. And so let's take a look at what we have on the outside here. Outside here is just next to the living room. So it's actually the unblocked view. Uh, it's a sliding door, it's nice also. Okay, so this unblocked view, you can have a chair here. At night, you can just sit down and have a very, very chill area. This is a very quiet. Leisure Park is a very peace and quiet area. So at night, it's normally very peaceful and you can be here. Just see the outside. It's peaceful and quiet. And this view is an unblocked view. So it's actually a very nice view that most people would want also. And you can actually see the facility, the swimming pool, and all this as well because this unit is just next to the facility. So you guys can just go out and use the swimming pool and all. So if you guys are interested in this video, do let me know in the description link below that you want to have a private tour with me. I will see you in Leisure Farm. Bye-bye.